Nearing the end of its first week, the French Open still offers plenty of on-court and off-score action. We offer you a stroll through some of the best moments that unfold today, from Madison Keys almost nailing a quiz to pair and Londero diving here and there for lack of a swimming pool. One blast from the past, we know that you know it, because if by this time a tennis fan isn't aware of that special fact, they might as well have had no connection in the past. Days or have been living under rock, Roger Federer played on this Friday against Kasper Ruud, young Norwegian whose most proclaimed quality lately regards him being the son of Christian Ruud the same Ruud senior. Who was in the Swiss legend's first Grand Slam draw. Even if the A has been a little saturated with this story, here are two less talked about facts about it. Both events happened 20 years apart, 1999 and 2019, and B. Federer played his first Grand Slam match at Roland Garros, 1999, and he registered today his 400th major open match. How's this for longevity? When Federer played his first Grand Slam match in 1999, Christian Rude was in the French Open draw with him. 20 years later, Federer will play Rude's 20-year-old son Casper in round 3 of the 2019 French Open. Photo of the Rudes, https colon slash slash t dot co slash 3 foo 2 z c p n f d pig dot twitter dot com slash sablack u n r g m s Christopher Clary, at Christoph Clary, May 29th, 2019 Federer is the only player, man or woman, to have achieved such a feat. He will next face Leonardo Mayer, who put a final point to Nicolas Mahou's fairy tale like evolution. 2. What's the score? During the battle against Pablo Carreno Buster, Binoir Pair had a serious discussion with the umpire about the score, but not his. Sitting on his bench, the bearded owner of the best backhand on tour according to Kane Ishikori, questioned his referee about the match which opposed fellow French Lucas Puy to Martin Clizan. When he was told that his countrymen had lost 9-7 in the last set, Per answered, I know, to the umpire's emphatic, that stuff. A recent Leon champion outlived his compatriot in the draw and will face his Japanese fan, Kane Ishikori, next. 3-10 out of 10. Well, almost. Madison Keys is one talented person, and not only a tennis. She got the nearly perfect score at Eurosport Stop Spin Quiz which involve fashion, boys band, and autographs. The Bachelor Rose Boy Band's microphone questionable fashion choices woman dancing it's time for it Madison. Keys to take on the top spin quiz tennis. UK, May 31, 2019, the American booked her place in the fourth round by getting past Priscilla Hon. Four dusty but sweet, most of players tend to grumble when they find out spots of red dirt on their clothes, but not Juan Ignacio Londero. The Argentinian's first time in a Grand Slam main draw has also become his first time getting to the second week of a major, and he decided to celebrate it at its fullest, not kneeling but lying down on the court. Londero, at Juan Londero, info at Galut's movie camera at Eurosport. Ruopic.twitter.com slash cjxasder1j, double full 28, at double full 28, May 31, 2019 Londero will have a tough fourth round against defending champion and 11 times title holder, Rafael Nadal. Five pair took a dive, the French stole the attention again today, but this time during his doubles match alongside Leander Pays. It seems like both players did the most to confuse their opponents, yet the funniest moment was when the Indian just looked at his partner falling off the court into the stands and played as if nothing had happened. Talk about partners being in sync face with tears of joy, happy to get a W with at Ben Pair and be back at Roland Gross, thank you to everyone who came out to support us. See you in the next round on coming fist medium skin tone. Bonus, Juan Martín del Potro was in the mood for hugs yesterday. As Simona Halep arrived in the press room to answer the media's questions, the Argentinian was still being recorded for TV, and let her wait a little.
before finally leaving the spotlight to the Romanian the 6, six tower bowed to rapper 5 six, laughing Halep in a heartfelt hug. At Simona, Halep hugs Juan Martín del Potro in the press conference room in Paris after she had to wait for his TV interview to finish pig.twitter.com slash Joe Jimmy 48 photography at JJ Love Stennis May 30, 2019 Let's blog ads. Why?